Hello everyone, hello. Today we are doing live streaming of the mock quiz 3. The mock quiz 3 today we are going to do. It's just 15 days to go for NEET 2020 and I have come another, you know, I have come to you with another set of 20 questions which are very important for your preparation. They are really very important for your preparation. They are going to help you in your final preparation for your NEET. Just 15 days to go. I want all of you to join in numbers in more and more numbers so that we can start off we can start off with today's session we can start off with today's session it's a jam-packed session today again 20 question you can chat with me in the live chat box i want all of you to say hello to me so that i can know the names of all of you and i can see that all of you are there okay so you uh, you know say hi to me say hi to me and hello to me we are doing live streaming of the mock quiz 3 we will solve 20 questions together okay you will tell me the correct answer in the comment section in the live session okay so harishri is there Harish, harishri has joined okay harishri hi hello once again welcome once again harishri do share the link of this roadside walker has joined welcome roadside walker has also come okay so roadside walker roadside walker is there harishri is there another another set of 20 questions very important questions today okay so harishri and roadside walker do share the link okay you know what you have to do you have to you know share the link so that more and more people can join more and more people can join and we can do this mock quiz mock quiz 3 today okay so come on come on share the link with everyone so that more and more people can join i will come with the first question i will yeah and i will come with the first question i will come with the first question very soon i will come with the first question very soon we will start off with today's session the first question will appear on your screens very soon i'm going to come up with that okay come on say hi to me in the chat box so that i can know that you have joined me and we will start off with today's session we will start off with today's session we will start off with today's session the first question are you ready for the first question everyone come on are you ready for the first question first question are you all ready for the first question the mock quiz 3 okay so i will start off with today's session i will start off with today's session and you know i will start off with today's session you can all tell me the correct answer of first question the first question is there on your screen glycoprotein and glycolipid they are present on cell membrane which helps in cell to cell recognition are formed by combined process of come on tell me tell me in the comment section the correct answer for this glycoprotein and glycolipid they are present on cell membrane you can read the question and you can tell me the correct answer in the comment box then i will also explain you i will also explain you come on do it can you tell me the correct answer in the comment section come on everyone in the live chat box in the live chat box the correct answer for glycoprotein and glycolipid they are present on cell membrane which helps in cell to cell recognition they are formed by the process of come on harishri roadside walker tell me the correct answer for this question i'm waiting tell me the correct answer okay harishri says it's one harishri says it's one that it is endoplasmic reticulum and mitochondria come on anyone else anyone else wants to try roadside walker says it's two endoplasmic reticulum and vacuole okay so we have two answers we have two answers till now harishri says it's one roadside walker says it's two okay okay i will tell you the correct answer i will tell you the correct answer don't worry i'm there okay see the process of you know the process of making of glycoprotein glyco protein protein and glycoprotein and glycolipid where does this take place can you remember the cell organelle where this you know glycoprotein and glycolipid they are made they are made the godfather says it's one endoplasmic reticulum and mitochondria 
glycolipid and glycoprotein where are they made the godfather says it's one godfather try to you know try to uh, you uh, uh, that memorize that where the glycoprotein and glycolipid made can anyone tell me in the comment section where the glycolipid and glycoprotein made see in endoplasmic reticulum endoplasmic reticulum there uh, there are two uh, types of endoplasmic reticulum there are there are two types one is rough and the other one is is smooth okay one is rough and the other one is is smooth okay and rough there is present of ribosomes there is present of ribosomes and this due to this presence of a ribosome they help in protein synthesis okay they help in protein synthesis and the you know the smooth one was mainly mainly it was involved in steroid synthesis it was mainly involved in like like the the smooth endoplasmic reticulum can anyone tell me the smooth endoplasmic reticulum what does it make the smooth endoplasmic reticulum is responsible for making what come on everyone i want all of you i want all of you to tell me the correct answer in the comment section the question is glycoprotein and glycolipid they are present in the cell membrane which helps in cell to cell recognition are formed by the process you know combined process of combined process of come on everyone in the chat in the chat box come in the chat box and tell me road side walker says no ribosome no ribosome and in yeah in a smooth endoplasmic reticulum there is no ribosome yeah in a smooth endoplasmic reticulum there is no ribosome see the glycoprotein and glycolipid they are mainly they are mainly produced by they are mainly produced in the golgi body or the golgi apparatus okay and endoplasmic reticulum also the smooth endoplasmic reticulum also helps in this so the correct answer for this is the correct answer for this is third endoplasmic reticulum and golgi body everyone got that everyone got that with this we will move to the next question for today come on it's a very interesting question it's a very interesting question you have to match the following find out the correct match from the following table now all of you do that and tell me the correct answer in the comment section come on everyone do this question and tell me the correct answer in the comment section come on i want the correct answer in the comment section can anyone tell me the correct answer for this in the uh, you know the polysaccharide you have to match the column sanjay rock says it's two you know you have to find out the correct match in the following table see the three tables column one column two column three very carefully and then answer and then answer take your time i am giving you time take your time and then tell me take your time and then tell me come on take your time and then tell me Sanjay Rock says it's two. Sanjay Rock saying it's two. That is, lipid is present in the acid insoluble fraction. It's a bio macro molecule. Uh, you have to find out the correct match and let's see what is the correct match. Sanjay Rock says it's two. I want others also to give me the answer so that then I can tell you the correct answer. Come on, everyone. we are doing 20 questions today we are doing these 20 questions today they are very important they are very important for your preparation we are doing these 20 questions they are really important for your preparation for your final preparation of neat for your final preparation of neat these questions they are really important i want all of you to participate and tell me the correct answers harishri says it's one only one okay okay harishri uh, you are correct the correct answer is one the correct answer is one you have to find out the correct match you have to find out we have to here you know find out the correct match and now see column 1 says it's polysaccharide and is present in the acid insoluble fraction that is correct it is a bio macro molecule it is a bio macro molecule then we have lipid lipid okay lipid it is present in the acid insoluble fraction 
acid insoluble fraction is it present in the bio macromolecule is it present in the bio uh, like bio macromolecule lipid come on the bio macromolecule is it present in the bio macromolecule lipid do you remember the lines which are there the lines which are there in the ncrt the lines of ncrt if you remember the lines of ncrt then you will be able to solve this question then you will be able to solve this question if you you know if you know the now the nucleic acids the nucleic acids the nucleic acids acid insoluble fraction hari churi lipid is a micro yeah lipid is micro lipid is micro except lipid all of them they are present in the bio macro they are they all are bio macro molecules so this is wrong this is not a bio macro molecule it's a bio micro molecule okay now nucleic acid is a bio macro molecule they have written bio micro molecule so all of them they are present in the acid insoluble fraction this is correct for all of them this is correct for all of them they are all present in the acid insoluble fraction but the thing is but the thing is you know polysaccharide they are present in the acid insoluble fraction and they are bio micro molecule okay they are they are bio micro molecule uh, acid insoluble fraction and they are bio micro molecule uh, now lipid is is, is there in the, which is there in the bio micro molecule so uh, only one is correct only one is correct because you know this is also wrong and this is also wrong so only one is correct yeah very good very good harish ji and nucleic is macro okay so everyone got that everyone got that so correct answer for this is one correct answer for this is one only one with this we'll next to come to the next question the process of respiration in green plants a easy question for all of you so easy question the process of respiration in green plants occurs in occurs when or in tell me the correct answer for it tell me the correct answer in the chat box i want all of you to participate in large numbers tell me the correct answer in the comment section in the chat box tell me the correct answer for this three only when photosynthesis is in progress see the process of respiration in plants process of respiration in plants it is occurring all the time it is occurring all the time whether it is day whether it is night whether the photo plant is doing photosynthesis or not the plant is doing respiration because see respiration is needed for what for energy production for energy production for energy production and energy production is required 24/7 otherwise how will the metabolic activities of the plant take place so you know this is done 24/7 so the correct answer is the correct answer would be 4 okay i want others also to, to participate in large numbers and tell me the correct answer for this okay with this we'll move to the fourth question for today how many carbohydrate digesting enzymes in the list given below they are found in the intestinal juice enterokinase chemotrypsin amino peptidase pepsin lactase renin carboxy peptidase nuclease nucleotidase maltase and sucrase now out of these how many they are present uh, are are basically the digestive juice which are carbohydrate digesting come on tell me tell me the correct answer for this in the chat box come on everyone in the chat box tell me the correct answer for this everyone in the chat box tell me the correct answer for this question i want to see the correct answer in the chat box let's see who gives the correct answer in the chat box first how many of them they are carbohydrate digestive enzymes which are found in the intestinal juice which are found in the intestinal juice come on let's see that let's see that if any can one can give me the correct answer in the chat box if any one can give me the correct answer in the chat box sanika kadam says it's 2 that is 3 okay sanika kadam sanya according to sanika kadam it is the answer the correct answer is 3 that is that is uh, that is second answer that is three enzymes are there let's see what are these three enzymes the carbohydrate digestive enzymes we have to see the carbohydrate digesting enzymes so let us now see enterokinase no chemotrypsin no chemotrypsin chemotrypsin is not a, it is a protein digesting enzyme then amino peptide is no the pepsin it is also not is a pepsin basically is present in stomach it is present in stomach then comes lactase the lactase you know it is responsible for digesting lactose okay it is you know responsible for digesting lactose 
renin no it is a milk protein digesting enzyme then carboxypeptidase no carboxypeptidase again for the peptide nucleus no nucleotidase no sucrase yes and uh, maltase yes so maltase and sucrase they are the correct answer though so of course the correct answer is two that is three enzymes are there okay so sanika kadam you were correct remy dikshit has joined uh, very good evening remy dikshit you also give me the correct answer in the chat box do share the link of the live stream with your friends so that they also can join and do solve solve questions with you okay remy so everyone do join this live quiz it's a live quiz mock test happening right now 20 questions out of which we have reached to fifth fifth question for today the fifth question is there on your screens okay so uh, which of the following is correct msh influences metabolism pigmentation menstrual cycle and defense capability so you have to read the four statements take your time read the four statements and then tell which are wrong and which are correct come on take your time and then tell me out of them which how many of them they are go, uh, like uh, wrong and how many of them they are correct come on take your time and then give the correct answer take your time and then give the correct answer the four statements they are there the four statements they are there come on let's see who gives the correct answer first let's see who gives the correct answer first Let's see who can give me the correct answer first. In the chat box, come on, everyone. In the chat box, I want to see the correct answer. I want to see the correct answer. Come on, in the chat box. Sanika Kadam says it's one. Okay. Sanika Kadam is saying. it's one that a and c are wrong and b and d they are correct so according to sanika kadam it's it is you know uh, it is uh, the a and c which are wrong and uh, then b and d which are correct okay let's see that let's see that c the correct answer is the correct answer is 3 the correct answer is 3 now according to the correct answer that a c and d are correct let let us see MSH influences metabolism, pigmentation, menstrual cycle, and different capability. Yeah, that is correct. Sanika is also saying that is Sanika is saying that is wrong. Okay. Now ACTH, ACTH. What is ACTH? What is the full form of ACTH? Adrenocorticotrophic hormone. Adreno. It is adrenocorticotrophic hormone. Adreno. Adrenocorticotrophic hormone. It is adrenocorticotrophic hormone. and adrenocorticotrophic hormone it works on the adrenal you know it acts on the adrenal cortex it acts on the adrenal cortex not the adrenal medulla not the adrenal medulla so this statement is wrong in adult women hyperthyroidism may cause menstrual cycle to become irregular that is also correct okay now receptor for steroid hormones they are found inside cytoplasm this is also correct which means the answer is 3 that is a c and d are correct and b is wrong with that we'll move to the next question fats and uh, oils they are glycerides in which fatty acids are esterized with is to ride with okay come on adrenocorticotrophic hormone harishvi very good it's adrenocorticotrophic hormone now tell me tell me the correct answer for the sixth question which is there on your screens come on tell me the correct answer Sanika Kadam says it's one that the answer this question is very easy fats and oils they are glycerides in which fatty acids are esterized with glycerol the correct answer is glycerol Harish Reed it says it's one it was a very easy question with that we'll move to the next question match the following correctly now match the following correctly and then tell me the correct answer for this come on everyone i want to see the correct answers in the chat box everyone in the chat box tell me the correct answer
tell me the correct answer in the chat box come on i want to see the correct answer in the chat box okay so match the following correctly you have to match the following correctly and then tell me the correct answer okay you have to then tell me the correct answer see lacteals the lacteals they are present they are basically the lymph vessels what are lacteals they are basically the lymph vessels which are present in the villi which are present in the villi and which are responsible for the absorption of fats okay now chylomacrons they are a small fat you know protein coated fat globules so fats okay microvilli microvilli is a brush border appearance it is a brush border appearance which is present in the small intestine and then you have hepatic lobules which are which is present there in the skin uh, in the liver in the liver hepatic lobules they are the structural they are the structural they are the structural and functional functional cells of you know, it's they are the structural and functional units of liver okay so hepatic lobules okay so the correct answer is second the correct answer is second correct answer a matches with b b matches with c c matches with d and d matches with a so the correct answer would be second the correct answer would be second with this we'll move to the next question for today the eighth question is there on your screen oxisomes they are sub microscopic particles present on the they are present on the come on tell me okay two the you know uh, the people are you know harishri saying harishri saying it's two sanika kadam saying it's two outer membrane of the nucleus outer membrane of the nucleus the oxisomes oxisomes no the correct answer is three the surface of inner membrane of mitochondria the surface of inner membrane of mitochondria this is the correct answer surface of inner membrane of mitochondria what are these oxisomes basically these are these are f0 f1 particles which are you know which are present they are in the atp 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 synthase enzyme atp synthase enzyme do you remember it was for the previous question okay it was for the previous question sir 2 sir 2 is of question 8 Two is of question eight. No, no nucleus. No, Harishvi. It's not nucleus. It's not nucleus. It's not nucleus. You got message late, sir. Okay, it's okay. Now the thing is, surface of the inner membrane of mitochondria. The correct answer for eight is three. The correct answer for eight is three. That is the surface of inner membrane of mitochondria. This is the correct answer. This is the correct answer. Okay. So, sorry, I mean two or seven. Two for seven. You meant two for seven. Okay, you meant two for seven. That's correct. Second was correct for two. Okay. Now for eight, it is three. For eight, it is three, which is the correct answer. Okay. Now with this, we'll move to the next question. That is the ninth question. Everyone, come on, do it. The ninth question. Now what you can do is for you know with the option, you can tell me the question number as well. with the option you can tell me the question number as well so that there is no confusion for which question you are telling the answer okay you can tell me the question number as well like you can see q9 and then the option okay q9 q10 q11 like that you can tell me so that there will be no confusion regarding the options and the question let's see who gives the correct answer now Come on everyone give me the correct answer for this Okay for 9 it's 2 for 9 it's 2 harishri says it's 2 in solids 
okay so diffusion is obvious it is obvious diffusion is obvious in uh, in gases and liquids but diffusion in solids rather than of solids it's more likely it is like the direct ncrt line it is the direct ncrt line the correct answer is of course two arishri very good it's the correct answer is two uh, okay sanika kadam said it's two sanika kadam said it's two sorry it was not harishri it was sanika kadam who said it's two so the Ka sanika kadam you are perfectly correct it's two the correct answer is two with this we'll move to the next question the 10th question is there on your screens which is not a superized cell come on come on which is not a superized cell yeah yeah i saw that i saw that harishri i saw that that it was not you it was sanika kadam come on now the correct answer for 10th question everyone whoever are watching come in the live chat box come in the live chat box and give me the correct answer come in the live chat box and give me the correct answer give me the correct answer i want to see the correct answer in the chat box let's see who can give me the correct answer come on give me the correct answer in the chat box which is not a superized cell which of the following is not a superized cell whether is it cox cell okay superized superized means the presence of a layer called superin superin okay harishri it's okay if you don't know it if you don't know it go to the chapter plant anatomy plant anatomy okay it's a it's a thick layer it's a thick layer of superin superin is a material superin is a thick material which is present thick layer which is present and the cells which have are called superized cells and the cells which does not have this layer they are called as non superized cells okay so basically the xylem and complementary cells they do not have this superin layer only cork cell have the superin only cork cell have the superin so they are asking which which is not a superized cell so the correct answer would be fourth fourth that is complementary cell and xylem they do not have the superin they only the cork cell only have superin they have only superin okay hi sanjay and hi sanjay a very good evening very good evening do solve these questions with me in the chat box the next question is going going to come on your screen which point is incorrect with regarding of the first sound first hard sound regarding the first hard sound which of the following is incorrect yeah cork is cork cell is superized okay harishri cork cell is superized now there is 11th question there on your screen there is 11th question there on your screen and tell me the correct answer of this 11th question come on everyone whoever is watching do give me the correct answer for this 11th question in the chat box right now come on let's see sanjay kamble if you haven't subscribed my channel till now do subscribe it i am doing these kinds of live session every day every day i am doing these kinds of live sessions not if if not every day then every in, in like in every alternate days okay so and these are very important because i'll be you know i come with the hand picked questions which are impo very important for your neat preparation and as you know there are there is only like few days left for the neat neat to happen so do solve these sessions do you know do these sessions with me do subscribe my channel and press the bell icon so that you get the notification as soon as i come live come on i'm waiting for the answer for this question come on which point is incorrect regarding the first hand sound now it is produced at the beginning of ventricular systole this is correct at the you know at the at the beginning of ventricular systole systole is contraction contraction of ventricular ventricles you know the first hard sound is produced which is known as lub the first hard sound is known as lub okay and you know it is associated with the closure of tricuspid and bicuspid valve this is also correct it is you know associated with the closure when the bicuspid valve and the tricuspid valve they close together the first hard sound that is the first hard sound that is uh you know lub is produced it is called as lub we are talking about lub it is high pitch sound for short period no 
this uh, no it's not even to harishri it's not even to the correct uh, you know incorrect one is it is high pitch sound for short period no it is high pitch sound for long period we have two hard sounds l u double b lub and d u p dub lub and dub okay lub and dub okay so the lub is for longer duration lung lub is for longer duration even you can hear that it even you can hear that the lub lub is for longer duration the second hard sound is is for very 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 short duration dug 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 like that okay so the second hard sound is okay it, it's very it's uh, it's for very small duration so it is not the lub which is for short period it is the dub which is for short period okay okay it it's okay hari hari shri that's how you learn okay it's okay so they we were looking for incorrect statement and fourth is the incorrect statement so answer is fourth with this we'll move to next question 12th question on your screens everyone identify the correct statements come on read the correct read the statements and tell me the correct in the comment section i want to know the correct answer for this come on everyone the correct answer for the 12th question identify the correct statements identify the correct statements let's see if anyone can give me the correct answer in the chat box i am looking for substances that have hydrophilic moiety the substances the substances that have hydrophilic moiety find it difficult to pass through the membrane is it a correct statement or the wrong statement first statement is correct or wrong first statement is correct you know hydrophilic means what hydrophilic means what water loving they are water they are water loving they are water loving okay and the substances which are water loving which have like moiety or which have like uh, for water for water for water okay moiety find it difficult to pass through the membrane they find it difficult to pass through the membrane because the membrane it is high, the maximum portion of the membrane cell membrane it is hydrophobic in nature it is hydro phobic in nature okay so they find it difficult okay so the first statement is correct porins they are channel present in the eukaryotic cell no porins are basically present on on the prokaryotic cells they are present in the prokaryotic cell simple and facilitated division show common characteristics like selection and saturation see selection is there in facilitated diffusion in facilitated diffusion but in simple diffusion simple diffusion there is no selection no no selection there is no selection okay there is no selection so this is also incorrect so b is incorrect c is incorrect different proteins in a membrane play major role in both active as well as passive transport this is correct so the correct answer would be fourth so the correct answer for fourth is 12th is fourth with this we'll move to the next question for today come on tell them fibin it's a very easy question it's a very easy question very easy question i want answers in like seconds i want answers in seconds very easy question this is very easy question this is tailed amphibian which out of these is a tailed amphibian toad are you saying toad harishri no it's not toad rana is frog rana is basically frog okay and frog does not have tail toad does not have tail hyla is basically tree frog tree frog and this does not also have tail this does not it's the ichthyophis ichthyophis is also known as salamander it is also known as salamander and it is all it is the tailed amphibia it is tailed amphibia salamander it's amphi ichthyophis amphibia everyone got that okay i know i'm confused with the tadpole okay it's okay it happens now the 14th question there on your screens radial symmetry is found in again a very simple question come on again a very simple question 
there on your screens is radial symmetry is found in harishri are you saying it's one for for the 14th question one for the 14th question like for you for, are you saying come on in the chat box i want everyone to participate in the chat box what is the correct answer for 14th question what is the correct answer for the 14th question then tell me the correct answer for the 14th question radial symmetry radial symmetry we have two types of symmetry if there is symmetry present uh, if there is symmetry prasanika kadam says it's two silent rate sino force and kinodams very good sir sanika kadam sanika kadam you are correct it's the silent rates it's the tino force and it is the echinoderms which have the radial symmetry and in echinoderms it is the adult which have it is the adult which have radial symmetry while larva have bilateral symmetry ral larva have bilateral symmetry adult have echin echin adult echinoderms they have radial symmetry so the radial symmetry is found in silent traits it is found in tino force and it is found in echinoderms so the correct answer is 2 with this next question 15 question on your screens which one of the following types of animals share four chambered heart again very easy question this is very easy question this is which of the following types of animals share a uh, four chambered heart share the four chambered heart come on crocodiles birds and mammals roadside walker saying 14 plus 2 okay okay 14 you uh, harishri for 14 you were saying 2 now for 15 hari i think roadside sanika kadam 2 harishri 2 okay yeah the correct answer is 2 because crocodile is the only reptile which has which has four chambered heart and birds and mammals have birds and mammals have four chambered heart already okay so the correct answer is 2 Harishri roadside walker everyone is correct Radhika Kadam you are correct now with this we'll move to the next question 16 question which of the following is not the function of sympathetic nervous system which of the following is not the function of synthetic sympathetic nervous system come on everyone come on everyone tell me the correct answer for 16th the correct answer which of the following is not the function of sympathetic nervous system sanika kadam says it's four dilates pupil dilates pupil sanika kadam it is the function of sympathetic nervous system no it's not four it is third the causes of erection of paris in erection of paris is not caused by sympathetic nervous system it is not caused by sympathetic nervous system inhibition of maturation inhibits defecation del dilates people that is all done by sympathetic nervous system except three which is the cause of the erection of paris okay now with this we'll move 17th question 17th question is there on your screen tell me the correct answer for the 17th question come on everyone tell me the correct answer for the 17th question part of chromosome which is related with the aging process in human part of chromosome which is related with the aging process in human everyone in the chat box come on the part of chromosome which is related with the aging process in human it's yeah uh, sanika kadam uh, sanika kadam you are little doubtful about it but the correct answer is one it's telomere 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 is basically responsible for the production of you know or for the expression of such genes which are responsible for aging it which are responsible for aging okay so the correct answer is telomere okay everyone note that it's telomere which is responsible for the aging process okay now this question very easy question again very easy question again there are four sketches a b c and d there are four sketches a b c and d and you know you just have to see which one of the following is correctly matched or you know correctly described and tell me in the comment section tell me in the comment section which one of them is correct
come on the correct answer for the 18th question that we are doing today can anyone tell me the correct answer for the 18th question i'm waiting for the answer in the chat box i'm waiting for the answer in the chat box what is a it is compound epithelium it is compound epithelium it is present in skin it is present in skin and it is there the function is protection otherwise you can see all these diagrams all these diagram they are given in the ncrt okay harishree says it's two and uh, roadside walker says it's four but roadside walker harishree go and see see these are bone cells osteocytes okay then which definitely means it's bone okay now connect by the bone to muscle dense irregular connective tissue uh, they, you know so uh, they have not matched it correctly so the correct answer is 3 it's a the compound epithelium and the rest diagrams you can find it them in the ncrt and see the correct explanation for them or the correct uh, you know how they belong and their tissue their location and function all these tissue they are given in the ncrt do go through them do go through them and see them a is you know a is compound epithelium it is present in the skin and it is there for protection it is there for protection okay everyone okay now with this we'll move to the next question for today the second last question for today 19th question on on your screen it's a very easy question diagrammatic question it's a very easy diagrammatic question come on everyone tell me the correct answer for this recognize the figure you have to recognize the figure and then you have to tell the correct match recognize the figure and find out the correct matching come on everyone do participate in the comment section do participate in the comment section one malice in case states and tiny tympanic membrane very good Harish Shri you are perfectly correct you are right you are the first one to give the correct answer the correct answer is malice in case states the correct answer is malice in case and states which are the three ear ossicles which are present which are what the three ear ossicles which are present okay so malice in case and states malice in case and steps is there and the tympanic membrane tympanic membrane tympanic membrane so now the correct answer is the correct answer is one the correct answer is one that is malus malus and cus steps and then the tympanic membrane okay now with this we'll move to next question the last question for today it's a very easy question a foramen magnum uh, a foramen which is found at the base of the skull the skull okay so you have to tell me it's a very easy one very easy one i want answers in like microseconds everyone can tell me the correct answer for this in microseconds come on let's see who gives the correct answer foramen of magnum very good hari shri it's the correct answer is third the foramen of magnum is there which is present at the base of the skull the base of the skull if you like this session if you like this session do you know subscribe my channel do subscribe my channel you can also book one on one sessions with me you can also book one on one sessions with me i am there on sulekha as well I am plus educator on an academy as well so you can book one on one sessions with me if you want to you know get personalized sessions on any topic on any topic if you want to take personalized sessions i am there for you you can book that the description you know the link is given there in the description box for more videos for more videos do subscribe my channel for personalized session you can go to the link which is given in the description box box you can book it with me we we can learn live okay you can book personalized session with me okay and uh, you know i will come live like this you can subscribe my channel and do share also so that i get maximum support bye bye everyone take care take care we will meet again very soon in again a live session in a new live session okay so bye bye till then take care all of you all of you take a good care of yourself good night have a good nice tasty lunch and we will meet again so bye bye